Phase two of a clinical drug trial for an oral insulin drug is underway in South Africa. Now that is a revolutionary delivery system for insulin. We've talked about it on this program before. The maker of the drug is a small market cap company called Oramed. Joining us with this first on Fox interview is Oramed Chief Executive Nadav Kidron. Nadav, welcome back to the program. Thank you. Nice to be here. Let's set out the ground rules for a second. This is oral insulin. You take it in the form of a drink or a pill, right? Yeah, exactly. No needles. No needle. Does that have, uh, apart from the delivery system, nobody likes needles, but does it have other advantages? Yeah, exactly. You see, what Oramed did by enabling us to take insulin orally, it's not only about the patient's compliance, which is huge, because everybody doesn't want to take an injection, everybody likes to take a pill better. Mm. But the advantage with oral insulin is that it mimics the physiological way that the body works, because what it does, it goes into the liver first, and only then into the bloodstream. Mm. Unlike the current way, which goes into the bloodstream first. Clinical trials in progress. Why South Africa? Well, South Africa is actually a good place because of a few reasons. Besides the relatively lower cost than, you know, Europe and the United States, it's an opportunity to get a place where you can have a higher level of medical, you know, medical people, and you can get a trial done very fast on a very high level of professionals. So we're definitely going to do more trials in the United States that will follow, but we're starting off with South Africa. Now, other companies presumably have an oral delivery system for insulin, but only you are in advanced clinical trials. Is that correct? Right, correct. Oramed, as far as I know, is, is definitely a, a leader in, in the aspect that we've gone a very long way uh, with our oral insulin trials. Does Oramed own the patent on this particular delivery system? It's actually a very interesting story. You know, it was developed by a group of scientists at Adassa Medical Center in Jerusalem who worked on it for over 25 years. And when Oramed was funded, we basically we got the intellectual property from the medical center into the company, but they still own a big piece of our company. Oh, so the, the guys, the doctors who developed this over this quarter century, they've got a chunk of the company, Oramed. Yeah, not only them, but the medical center, Hadassa, owns part of Oramed as well. Okay. Um, very small company, low cap. Um, I'm inclined to ask why. If you've got such a revolutionary system on your hands um, and you're in advanced clinical trials, nobody else is, why are you so small? That's Don't a, get it. That's a very good question. I have to tell you this morning, you know, I was, I was here eating, uh, having a coffee in a place and I met one of our investors and he, and he asked, what is new? You know, are we going to see you more on, on the news or whatever? I said, listen, I see my job as a CEO is not to run the PR, uh, PRIR department, but rather to be focused on getting the results. Okay, all right. Let's suppose you get, uh, it goes through. It's on the market. Is it less than $100 a month for this delivery system? Well, yeah, it's actually going to be less than $100 a month. So a normal uh, uh, patient w with uh, diabetes it would cost less than a hundred dollars a month. Yeah. How does that compare to the needle? Uh, well, it depends. You know, it depends how because different patients take different amounts. You know, some people take four times a day before every meal. Some okay. people take less. Right. Okay. It varies, obviously. But the idea is that the oral insulin, at least Oramed's oral insulin, is going to be very affordable. Real fast. Would it make any difference if Obama Care comes to America? I think. I think that if I, I, we're still waiting to see exactly what's going to be the revolution sure. of the healthcare in America. But I think as far as the FDA is concerned, you have to remember that what happens today to develop a drug costs you a fortune, it takes you a lot, a lot of time. And if the healthcare revolution will influence that, then the potential to see drugs like Oramed's oral insulin in the market faster is definitely there. Nadav Kidron, uh, Oramed, we got you. Come back and see us when we get the results of those trials. It'll be very interesting. Thank you very Thanks much.